Hello all. Today I am going to talk to you all about lymphoma. Lymphoma is a cancer of the immune cells. Broadly, lymphoma is of two different subtypes: Hodgkin lymphoma and non-Hodgkin lymphoma. Hodgkin lymphoma is again of five different subtypes. Non-Hodgkin lymphoma, it depends on which type of immune cell is involved. It is classified into B cell non-Hodgkin lymphoma and T cell non-Hodgkin lymphoma. The B cell non-Hodgkin lymphoma is of the aggressive variant and an indolent variant where the disease is very slow growing. The minority of them are called the T cell lymphomas which are very aggressive and comprise around 15% of the total non-Hodgkin lymphomas. Now what age do lymphomas present at? So Hodgkin lymphoma is got a bimodal presentation. So it happens in younger age group as well as in older individuals. Non-Hodgkin lymphoma is of the older age group but again children can also get non-Hodgkin lymphoma and I would say no age is exempt for any patient who develops non-Hodgkin lymphoma. Now what are the symptoms? Generally uh, patients present with drenching night sweat, fever which is of unexplained nature and significant weight loss which is generally more than 10% of the body weight over the last 6 months and of course they develop enlarged lymph nodes in various parts of the body. How do we diagnose lymphoma? Lymphoma is diagnosed by doing what is called as a biopsy of the whole lymph node which is called as excisional biopsy. Now how do we stage lymphoma? We have a scan called positron emission tomography which is called PET scan which scans the whole body also tells you where all there is involvement and how active the lymph node is involved. How do we treat this lymphoma? Depends on which type of lymphoma the patient has. If it is a Hodgkin lymphoma, we treat with chemotherapy. Non-Hodgkin lymphoma, again it is mainly chemotherapy but then there are also certain targeted therapies called rituximab. If the patient has got a specific type of lymphoma called B-cell lymphoma which are usually CD20 positive and this rituximab goes and attacks the CD20 positive tumor cells. Overall lymphomas are treated very well and most of them close to 80 to 90% are curable and they have a very good prognosis.